Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. People are checking in at a hotel. B. A man is giving a presentation in a boardroom. C. A chef is preparing food in a kitchen. D. A group of tourists is waiting in line at a museum. The correct answer is B. A man is giving a presentation in a boardroom. Number 2. A. Two people are sitting at a table in a cafe. B. A man is pointing while holding a tray of drinks. C. Customers are standing in line at a ticket counter. D. A cashier is scanning items at a checkout counter. The correct answer is B. A man is pointing while holding a tray of drinks. Number 3. A. People are working out in a gym. B. A group of friends is watching a movie in a theater. C. A woman is giving a presentation about space. D. Students are studying in a library. The correct answer is C. A woman is giving a presentation about space. Number 4. A. A group of people is jogging in a park. B. A woman is serving food at a cafe. C. Two people are walking along a beach. D. People are enjoying a meal in a park. The correct answer is D. People are enjoying a meal in a park. Number 5. A. A group of students is attending a lecture. B. A woman is filling out paperwork at a train station. C. People are shopping for groceries. D. A man is speaking to a cashier. The correct answer is B. A woman is filling out paperwork at a train station. Number 6. A. A group of people is attending a business meeting. B. People are waiting in line for a sale in a store. C. A woman is taking notes in a shopping mall. D. A man is giving a presentation in an office. The correct answer is C. A woman is taking notes in a shopping mall. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. What are the plans for the weekend? A. I have to finish my report. B. I'll let you know later. C. We're going hiking. The correct answer is C. We're going hiking. Number 2. Is there a discount for students? A. It's on the second floor. B. Yes, 15% off with a student ID. C. It starts next week. The correct answer is B. Yes, 15% off with a student ID. Number 3. Is this your first time here? A. Yes, I would like one. B. It's on the table. C. No, I visited twice before. The correct answer is C. No, I visited twice before. Number 4. Who is in charge of the sales department? A. It was great. B. I like sales. C. Mr. Robinson is. The correct answer is C. Mr. Robinson is. Number 5. Are you free for lunch today? A. Yes, I am available at noon. B. Let's have a meeting instead. C. I prefer Italian food. The correct answer is A. 
Yes, I am available at noon. Number 6. Why did you call the client yesterday? A. To confirm the meeting time. B. I was busy all day. C. No, I'm calling them tomorrow. The correct answer is A. To confirm the meeting time. Number 7. Who will lead the meeting? A. Yes, it's on Wednesday. B. Ms. Johnson will. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. Ms. Johnson will. Number 8. Where do you usually have lunch? A. At the cafe across the street. B. Yes, I'll join you. C. I brought my lunch today. The correct answer is A. At the cafe across the street. Number 9. What time does the movie start? A. It starts at 7 o'clock. B. No, I haven't seen the schedule. C. I have a different appointment. The correct answer is A. It starts at 7 o'clock. Number 10. Who has the quarterly report? A. Jane is working on it. B. Sure, I'll contact her. C. Yes, it's nearly finished. The correct answer is A. Jane is working on it. Number 11. How long will the repairs take? A. We'll call you when it's ready. B. The tools are in the truck. C. They should be done by Friday. The correct answer is C. They should be done by Friday. Number 12. Will you be attending the conference? A. It's next week. B. Yes, I'll be there. C. It's about marketing strategies. The correct answer is B. Yes, I'll be there. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Do you have the budget report ready for the meeting this afternoon? Yes, I do. I'll bring it with me. Perfect. See you at the meeting room at 2 p.m. See you then. When will the meeting take place? A. At 1 p.m. B. In the morning. C. At 2 p.m. The correct answer is C. At 2 p.m. Number 2. I'm working on the budget report for next month. Could you provide the sales figures? Absolutely. I'll send them over by the end of the day. Great. That will help a lot. What does the man need from the woman? A. Budget approval. B. Sales figures. C. Client contact. The correct answer is B. Sales figures. Number 3. Can we reschedule our lunch meeting? Something urgent came up? No problem. How about tomorrow at the same time? That works. I'll see you then. Perfect. I'll update our calendar. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Next week. B. Tomorrow. C. Today. The correct answer is B. Tomorrow. Number 4. Do you know if the meeting room is available this afternoon? Yes, I checked, and it's free after 2 p.m. Great. I'll book it from 2.30 to 3.30 then. Excellent. I'll be there. What time is the meeting room available? A. In the morning. B. After 5 p.m. C. After 2 p.m. The correct answer is C. After 2 p.m. Number 5. Can we discuss the marketing plan after lunch? Sure, I have time around 1.30 p.m. Perfect, I'll see you then. Let's meet in my office. When will they discuss the marketing plan? A. Before lunch. B. 
in the morning, c. after lunch. The correct answer is c. after lunch. Number 6. Are you attending the conference next week? Yes, I have already registered. Great. I'll see you there then. Looking forward to it. When is the conference? A. Next week. B. In two weeks. C. This week. The correct answer is A. Next week. Number 7. We need to finalize the travel arrangements for the business trip next week. Have you booked the flights yet? Yes, I booked them yesterday. We're flying out on Tuesday afternoon. Great. I'll take care of the hotel reservations then. When are they flying out for the business trip? A. Monday morning. B. Tuesday afternoon. C. Wednesday evening. The correct answer is B. Tuesday afternoon. Number 8. I've received the travel itinerary for our business trip next week. Great. Does it include all the flight details? Yes, we depart at 8 a.m. on Monday. Perfect. I'll make sure to be at the airport by 6.30 a.m. When will they depart for their business trip? A. On Monday. B. On Sunday. C. On Tuesday. The correct answer is A. On Monday. Number 9. I need to book a flight to New York for the conference next week. Do you prefer a morning or an afternoon flight? Morning, please. It's better to arrive early. What time of the day does the man prefer to fly? A. In the afternoon. B. At night. C. In the morning. The correct answer is C. In the morning. Number 10. I'm planning to take a few days off next month. Do you know which days yet? Probably the last week of March. All right, just make sure to submit the leave request before the end of this month. When is the woman planning to take leave? A. First week of April. B. Last week of March. C. First week of March. The correct answer is B. Last week of March. Number 11. Are you ready for our presentation to the board? Almost. I need another hour. We present at 4 p.m. sharp. I'll be ready by then. No worries. What time is the presentation? A. At 2 p.m. B. At 3 p.m. C. At 4 p.m. The correct answer is C. At 4 p.m. Number 12. Can you help me with the client's contract later? Sure, I have some time after lunch. Let's meet in my office around 2 p.m. All right, see you then. When will they meet to work on the client's contract? A. At 2 p.m. B. At 3 p.m. C. At 1 p.m. The correct answer is A. At 2 p.m. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. We are excited to announce the grand opening of our new art gallery downtown, featuring works from local artists and a live painting demonstration. The event starts at 5 p.m. and refreshments will be served. Come and support the local art scene. What time does the grand opening event start? A. At 5 p.m. B. With a painting demonstration. C. With local artists' works. The correct answer is A. At 5 p.m. Number 2. Join us for the farmer's market every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Fresh produce, homemade goods, and local crafts are available. It's a great way to support local farmers and artisans. Don't miss out on the special events and live music. When is the farmer's market held? A. Every Friday from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. Every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. C. Every Sunday from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m.
The correct answer is B. Every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Number 3. Join our free weekly yoga classes at the Community Center every Thursday from 6 p.m. to 1 p.m. These classes are open to all levels and no prior experience is required. Mats and water will be provided. We look forward to seeing you there. What day of the week are the yoga classes held? A. Thursday. B. Monday. C. Wednesday. The correct answer is A. Thursday. Number 4. We are excited to announce the launch of our new product line next week. Join us for the unveiling event on Monday at 10 a.m. There will be a live demonstration and an opportunity to meet the designers. Don't miss it. When is the unveiling event? A. Monday at 10 a.m. B. Tuesday at 11 a.m. C. Friday at 9 a.m. The correct answer is B. Monday at 10 a.m. Number 5. Welcome to the annual Charity Marathon. Today, we aim to raise funds for local shelters. All participants are encouraged to keep hydrated and wear appropriate footwear. Snacks and water stations are available along the route. Enjoy the race and thank you for your support. What is the purpose of today's event? A. To recruit new marathon runners. B. To promote new running shoes. C. To raise funds for local shelters. The correct answer is C. To raise funds for local shelters. Number 6. Attention shoppers! Our store is currently having a massive sale on all electronic items. Everything is marked down by up to 50%. Don't miss out on these amazing deals. The sale will last until the end of the month. When will the sale end? A. At the end of the month. B. Tomorrow. C. Next week. The correct answer is A. At the end of the month. Number 7. Our annual charity run will take place in Central Park this Sunday. Registration starts at 7 a.m. and the run begins at 8 a.m. Participants of all ages are welcome. Proceeds will go to local shelters. What time does the run start? A. 9 a.m. B. 7 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is C. 8 a.m. Number 8. Our annual tech conference will be held next month at the Downtown Convention Center. This year's theme is Innovation in Artificial Intelligence. Leading experts from around the world will present their latest research and development. Early bird registration ends November 15th, so be sure to sign up soon. When is the early bird registration deadline? A. November 15th. B. December 1st. C. October 31st. The correct answer is B. November 15th. Number 9. Welcome to the neighborhood meeting. Tonight we will discuss plans for the new community garden. The project aims to provide fresh produce to local residents and create a green space for everyone to enjoy. Your feedback and participation are highly valued. What is the main purpose of the meeting? A. To discuss the community garden. B. To plan a festival. C. To sell garden tools. The correct answer is C. To discuss the community garden. Number 10. Our business will be organizing an annual charity event next month. We encourage all employees to participate either by volunteering or donating. The event will begin at 10 a.m. and will include various fundraising activities. Let's come together and make a difference. What time does the charity event start? A. 12 p.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is B. 10 a.m.
Number 11. Attention passengers, the 1030 train to Riverside has been delayed by 15 minutes due to maintenance work. We apologize for the inconvenience. For more information, please check the service updates on our website. Why has the train been delayed? A. A technical fault. B. Bad weather. C. Due to maintenance work. The correct answer is C. Due to maintenance work. Number 12. This is an announcement for all passengers on flight 105 to New York. Boarding will commence in 15 minutes at gate 23. Please have your boarding passes and identification ready. Priority boarding is available for families with young children and those needing assistance. At which gate will boarding for flight 105 to New York begin? A. Gate 23. B. Gate 21. C. Gate 25. The correct answer is B. Gate 23. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, would you mind? Me the report by email. A, to send. B, sent. C, sending. D, send. The correct answer is. C, sending. Number two, she suggested. A consultant to improve efficiency. A. Hired. B. To hire. C. Hire. D. Hiring. The correct answer is D. Hiring. Number three. She. For this company since 2015. A. Has worked. B. Works. C. Is working. D. Worked. The correct answer is A. Has worked. Number four. They prefer by car rather than taking the train. A. Traveled. B. Traveling. C. Travel. D. To travel. The correct answer is D. To travel. Number five. The employee has worked here. 2010. A. From. B. Since. C. In. D. For. The correct answer is B. Since. Number six. They're used. Working late hours. A. On. B. For. C. To. D. In. The correct answer is C. 2. Number 7. We. The proposal by the end of the day. A. Will have reviewed. B. Have reviewed. C. Review. D. Are reviewing. The correct answer is A. Will have reviewed. Number 8. We finished the task. Time for the presentation. A. On. B. By. C. In. D. At. The correct answer is. C. In. Number 9. The contract. To be signed by the client tomorrow. A. Is being. B. Has. C. Is. D. Was. The correct answer is B. Has. Number 10. The presentation was so long. Everyone became tired. A. As. B. That. C. So. D. Then.
The correct answer is B. That. Number 11. She suggested. The meeting to next week. A. Postponing. B. Postponed. C. To postpone. D. Postpone. The correct answer is A. Postponing. Number 12. I'm looking forward. Meeting with you next week. A. On. B. To. C. 4. D. In. The correct answer is B. To. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Dear graduates, we are excited to announce our new mentorship program. Next month, stay tuned for more details. Best Alumni Association A. Start B. Starts C. Starting D. Started The correct answer is C. Starting Number 2. We are currently Applications for the position of Marketing Manager Interested candidates should submit their resumes by the end of this month. A. Acceptance. B. Acceptable. C. Accepting. D. Accepted. The correct answer is C. Accepting. Number 3. Dear Ms. Brown, we regret to inform you that due to the high volume of applications, your request has been we thank you for your interest. Regards, Recruitment Team. A. Denied. B. Deny. C. Denying. D. Denies. The correct answer is A. Denied. Number 4. Dear Dr. Brown, your appointment is for Monday at 10 a.m. If you need to reschedule, please let us know 24 hours in advance. Regards, Clinic Reception. A. Schedules. B. Scheduling. C. Schedule. D. Scheduled. The correct answer is D. Scheduled. Number 5. To all team members, please remember to submit your timesheets by the end of the week. This is important for accurate. Ew. A. Pay. B. Paid. C. Payroll. D. Payment. The correct answer is C. Payroll. Number 6. Dear Mr. Johnson, this is a reminder to update your contact information in our database before the end of this. I thank you for your cooperation. Sincerely, Customer Support. A. Weekend. B. Weekly. C. Weeks. D. Week. The correct answer is D. Week. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear Users, Our customer service hours will extend starting next month. We will now be available from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m., Monday through Sunday, to assist you better. We are committed to providing exceptional service and support. What is changing in the customer service hours? A. Extended service hours. B. Weekend support only. C. Shortened service hours. The correct answer is A. Extended service hours. Number 2. To all staff. Starting next week, there will be a change in the company's dress code policy. Employees are now required to wear business casual attire on weekdays, with casual dress permitted only on Fridays. We appreciate your adherence to the new policy. What is the new policy change? A. Casual dress every day. B. Business casual attire on weekdays. C. Formal attire every day. The correct answer is B. 
Business casual attire on weekdays. Number 3. Attention customers. We are updating our privacy policy to comply with new regulations. The updated policy will take effect on January 1st. Please review the changes on our website. Thank you. When will the updated privacy policy take effect? A. January 1st. B. February 1st. C. December 1st. The correct answer is A. March 1st. Number 4. Thank you for your continued support. In appreciation, we are offering an exclusive 15% discount to our newsletter subscribers on all purchases made through our website. Use code THANKYOU15 at checkout to redeem this offer. Valid through the end of the month. What is being offered? A. New product trial. B. Free shipping. C. Exclusive discount. The correct answer is C. Exclusive discount. Number 5. Dear Team, We have scheduled a series of training workshops next month to enhance our skills in digital marketing. These sessions will be held every Tuesday and Thursday from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Participation is mandatory. What is the purpose of the scheduled workshops? A. To train on customer service. B. To enhance skills in digital marketing. C. To introduce new software. The correct answer is B. To improve team building. Number 6. This is a reminder that the annual performance reviews will be conducted next week. All employees are required to schedule a meeting with their supervisor to discuss their progress and goals for the coming year. Please contact HR for scheduling assistance. What is the main purpose of this text? A. Promotion announcement. B. Performance reviews reminder. C. Holiday schedule. The correct answer is B. Performance reviews reminder. Number 7. Dear colleagues, we are excited to announce that we have partnered with a leading wellness platform to offer all employees access to various health and fitness resources. The platform will be live starting next week. Regards, Wellness Committee. What resource is being offered to employees? A. Discounted store vouchers. B. Additional vacation days. C. Health and fitness resources. The correct answer is C. Health and fitness resources. Number 8. Our latest software update includes several new features and performance improvements. Be sure to download and install the update to take advantage of these enhancements and keep your system running smoothly. What is the purpose of this text? A. To sell a new software package. B. To inform about a software update. C to address system issues. The correct answer is B. To inform about a software update. Number 9. Please note that our customer service hotline will have extended hours during the holiday season. From December 1st to December 31st, the hotline will be available from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. to handle increased call volumes. We are committed to providing excellent service during this busy period. What change is being implemented? A. Extended service hours. B. Product price reduction. C. New return policy. The correct answer is A. Extended service hours. Number 10. We are excited to announce the launch of our new mobile app, which allows you to manage your account track orders, and receive exclusive offers directly on your phone. Download it today from the App Store or Google Play. Happy using! What is the main announcement? A. The launch of a new mobile app. B. A new product release. C. A special discount event. The correct answer is A. The launch of a new mobile app. Number 11. Effective from next month, 
the office working hours will shift to 9 a.m., 6 p.m. to better accommodate our clients' needs. All departments are expected to adhere to the new timetable. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation in this adjustment period. What is changing? A. Employee benefits. B. Office working hours. C. Office locations. The correct answer is B. Office working hours. Number 12. Dear team, we are pleased to announce that our annual team building retreat will take place from October 10th to 12th. All employees are encouraged to join for an opportunity to enhance teamwork and collaboration. More details will follow soon. What is the event being announced? A. Quarterly business meeting. B. Office renovation. C. Annual team building retreat. The correct answer is C. Annual team building retreat. Number 13. Dear subscribers, we are updating our privacy policy to better protect your personal information. The changes will take effect on November 1st. Please review the updated policy on our website and contact us if you have any questions. When will the new privacy policy take effect? A. November 1st. B. October 1st. C. December 1st. The correct answer is A. November 1st. Number 14. To all employees due to maintenance work, the main entrance will be closed from June 10 to June 15. Please use the west side entrance during this period. We apologize for the inconvenience. Regards, Facilities Management. Which entrance should employees use during the maintenance period? A. East side entrance. B. West side entrance. C. Main entrance. The correct answer is B. West side entrance. Number 15. Dear employees, please note that our office will be closed on November 25th and 26th in observance of the Thanksgiving holiday. We will resume normal operations on November 27th. Wishing you a safe and happy holiday. Regards, Management. When will the office reopen after Thanksgiving? A. November 28th. B. November 27th. C. November 25th. The correct answer is B. November 29th. Number 16. Dear members, to enhance your experience, our gym will introduce new fitness classes starting next month. Check the schedule on our website for more details. We hope you enjoy these new additions. Best regards, the fitness club. What is being introduced at the gym? A. New equipment. B. New fitness classes. C. Extended hours. The correct answer is B. New fitness classes. Number 17. We are pleased to inform you that the annual shareholders meeting will take place on November 25th at 10 a.m. in the main conference hall. Attendance is highly encouraged, as we will be discussing the company's future plans and financial performance. Please RSVP by November 20th. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To notify about a meeting. B. To introduce new shareholders. C. To announce a company closure. The correct answer is A. To notify about a meeting. Number 18. Dear team, due to unforeseen circumstances, our scheduled meeting for this Friday has been postponed to next Tuesday at 10 a.m. Please adjust your calendars accordingly. Thank you for your flexibility. Best regards, HR Department. Why was this email sent? A. To confirm the meeting. B. To cancel the meeting. C to announce a change in meeting time. The correct answer is C, to announce a change in meeting time.